What's up guys, we're back, we're looking at some more MLB player props. In today's video, we have hit 10 of our last 14 MLB plays. Let's keep it going and cash more in today's video. This video applies to not just prize picks, but also sports books, underdog fantasy, no matter where you guys are, these lines should be available pretty much everywhere. So we're getting these free plays, but before we do so, don't miss out on joining the Dub Club. I'm offering a huge special offer right now. It's only $5 to join for the next two weeks. My prize picks profit is over $5,000, sleeper profit over $1,300. That's how you know that I am Red Bull and I'm a consistent long-term winner. I'm not just going on little sports where I'm having some really nice winners and then all the other time I'm losing. No, some days I have good days, some days I have bad days, but long term, I'm consistently winning as you can see right here. You see all the W's that we've been having in the dub club as of late. This does not even include the W's from I think the last two nights. I think these are like two days old. That's just a few of the W's that we've had. So don't miss out and join the dub club. If you don't know how it works, it, it just sends all the plays that I make straight to your phone through the dub club app, email, telegram, or discord. I assume it plays out to over 3.2 thousand subscribers. So get in right now. Link to join is down in my description or the top on the comment section for the July special offer. It's only $5 to join for the next two weeks. Best package, by the way, includes all sports and includes Discord chat, includes everything. And one last thing, if you want to research player props for yourself, I cannot recommend this tool enough. I will be using it in today's video. And it's a tool that I use to research all my player props. This tool right here is called Outlier. It helps you find data for a bunch of different player props. Let's say we want like Brian Buxton over one and a half hits, runs, and RBIs. It just shows you the graph and the different things. You can see how well he does against Ray and pitching and home games, things like that. There's a seven day free trial for Outlier down in my description and it's risk free. So if you don't like it, just cancel it. Seven day free trial for this tool is down in my description. They also have an app on the app store, which is amazing. But now let's hop into these plays. Just play responsibly at your own risk. Leave a like on the video and subscribe. I really would appreciate it. Most important thing though is to have those post notifications turned on. Let's get into it here. The first player prop to like in today's game is going to be a really early start, which is why it's important to have those post notifications turned on. But I'm just going to give you guys three plays in today's video. So don't worry if you don't get this first play out there, but I'm going to make it super quick. CJ Abrams over one and a half hits, runs, and RBIs. Like I said, it starts super soon. Dub Club got it first, of course. And if you have those notifications turned on, you will be able to get this one in. Let's take a look at CJ Abrams. And while I like the over here, I'm going to keep this one nice and quick. You can see right here what he's done against uh, this entire season, 63%. But against lefties, he's over this in 70% of games. They also have a shallow chance to win in today's game. They're like a minus 105 over in 60% versus lefties. But overall in wins, he's over in 72% of games. He is over two against Jose Quintana in terms of plate appearances, not in games going over his runs and RBIs, but uh, in those plate appearances, but that was back in 2022. I'm not super worried about that. Take a look at the pitcher arsenal. You can see right here what he's done against the sinker and the fastball, which he mainly throws against the sinker. He has a major 584 on base average. That is absolutely huge against that pitch. That's awesome. Right? That's what we're looking for when it comes to an over. If you take a look at the fastball, he's a 406 weighted on base average against the fastball. So that's also another really, really good sign. So I like, I like the spot a lot here for Abrams because that pitch mix is really good. He's been great in wins. He's great against left-handed pitching, especially. And overall, I think it should be a really good day for the Nationals and CJ Abrams. Before we get into our second and third play, you're probably already on price picks, but if you're not, right now is one of the best times to join. Promo code DMG will get you 25% off. We have a free square on the board of Jess of Je Jeffrey Esper. I don't even know. I don't know much about hot dog eating, but uh, he is a free score right now on the uh, prize picks board, as you can see right there. So it's a free score you can join on prize picks. You get just a free pick to get you started on prize picks, and this is available for all users. So promo code DMG will also get you a first in the pause match up to $100. All right, getting into player prep number two, we're going to stay in the hits, runs, and RBIs category here, and I'm going to scroll down until we find the Angels game. Actually, it'd probably just be easier to uh, search this one up. This one's going to be like four o'clock today. It's going to be Taylor Ward over hits, runs, and RBIs here. I also like him to have a hit in today's game. You could pair Abrams to have a hit with Ward to have a hit or, you know, just kind of mix and match him. But I do like Taylor Ward here over hits, runs, and RBIs. And kind of let me explain why here. So you can see right here what he's done. He's over in 42% of games this year. But how is he against left-handed pitching? Because he faces J.P. Sears today, a lefty. Against lefties, he's over in 67% of games. That is 10 out of 15 so far this entire season. They have a solid chance to win today. I believe they're also like a minus 105, minus 115, somewhere around there. In wins, he's over this in every single game against left-handed pitching. Overall, in games where they just win, he's over in 62%. So I think there is a little bit of upside for them to win today, and that would be a huge bonus right there for uh, Taylor Ward. If you take a look here at the pitch mix here and things like that, uh, Jay, first off, his track record against JP Sears is pretty solid. He has a 250 batting average and five plate appearances, which is pretty good considering he's also got on base one time, it seems like, uh, with likely a walk or hit by pitch, which is good. So he's gotten on base, it seems, two times out of five, which is awesome. That's a 400 on base percentage. If you take a look here at the uh, pitch mix here, he throws mainly the slider, but he also mixes in that fastball and the changeup. Uh, so against a slider, he has not been very good. He's over, he only has a uh, 257 on base average right there against a slider, which is 
not great. Uh, you definitely want that to be a little bit higher. But in terms of the fastball, he is a 360 weighted on base average against that, which is really, really good. The changeup, 369. So those are really, really good signs there. He throws those about 50% of the time, as you can see. He gets a sinker, by the way. He is also very, very good. A 374 weighted on base average. So as long as he's throwing, you know, not the slider constantly at Taylor Ward, I think you should be able to uh, get on base quite a bit here hopefully get us a hit. So yet again, another simple breakdown. I've been doing this constantly with these guys facing lefties, just trying to find guys that are good against left-handed pitching, guys who have a solid chance to win the game, and uh, just have a good track record against the pitcher and against the pitch mix. And now let's get into a pair if you guys need a pair for your plays today, because this pair has a pretty damn good payout, and I think it's one that uh, has a pretty decent chance to hit. It's going to be Corbin Burns over 17 and a half pitching outs today. So take a look at Corbin Burns here. By the way, if you were to pair this one with like a normal square on prize picks that's not a green goblin, uh, this would pay out like a 2.5x. So if you guys need a pair for just one of your plays today, I think Corbin Burns could be a good possibility to be your pair. Kind of let me explain why here. He's over this in all but three games this season. He's just over this in 12 straight games. So 82%, 14 out of 17, and 12 straight games he's been over this here. And he has a pretty good matchup today against the Mariners. Uh, take a look at his earned run line today. He is only a plus 115 under one and a half, which is a really, really nice sign. Uh, take a look at his walks today as well. He is extremely favored under two and a half, which is also a very, very good sign. Uh, so it's a really good thing for the over for these pitching outs. Seattle has been pretty bad, uh, really just overall. I mean, they rank dead last in batting average versus righties this year. 24th in on-base percentage. OPS is at 26. Total offense is about 20th. In the last 30 games, they've still not been very good either. They rank 28th in batting average in the last 30 games. And overall, Corbin Burns is just a very, very strong pitcher, as you can see. And if you know anything about baseball, you do know that Corbin Burns is a very strong pitcher. But uh, overall, I think it should be just be a really straightforward good spot. He has a really nice matchup here against Seattle. It's extremely, extremely juiced, which makes it a really good pair over on prize picks for the payout that it's offered. One last reminder to join the Dub Club with that huge special offer. It's only $5 for, to join with the link down in my description or the top on the comment section. Get access to all my plays, Discord chat, everything. On top of that, again, if you guys are not already on Outlier, check it out for yourself. There's a seven-day free trial down in my description. Absolutely love this tool. If you want to research player props, check out Outlier. If you want to research your plays yourself, you got to have a research tool and Outlier could be that for you. They also have an app on the app store. Like I said, you can download it and research player props right from your phone. So use that link down in my description, use that promo link, and that will help you guys get that seven day free trial. Thank you for watching. Happy 4th of July. If you want to see how I made over $5,000 on prize picks, watch this video right here.